Staff writer Zainal Mohammed and staff photographer Zara Sheikh try Yemeni-based coffees and desserts from Haraz and Saifani, two popular coffee shops well known for their unique flavors. Hi, my name is Zara and I'm a staff photographer. Hi, my name is Zainab and I'm a staff writer. And today we're going to be reviewing the Haraz and Saifani. First, we're starting off with Saifani. We have their rose cake, we have their strawberry croissant swirl, and then we have their Saifani ice signature coffee. So let's first start with the coffee. You can go. It has like a, the general taste of it is like, I would say biscotti. And it's very sweet, but there's also a hint of bitterness. So I think if you like a uh, classic coffee that's a little bit on the sweeter side, I think you would like this coffee. Um, it also has like a lot of these like tea aromatics, which is really good. Like for me, at least I love it. But um, if you're if you love sorts like that, then you should definitely try the Saifani latte. Okay, next we have the rose milk cake. Are you ready? Yeah. Grab your sword. Okay. Juice? Yeah. Ooh. Okay. It has this really like nice rose flavor, and it's really moist. So if you like rose, like this, a scent or like taste of rose, then you should definitely go for that because that's pretty good. And it's honestly not that sweet, so if you're not a fan of sweeter desserts, I think you would like this one. Next we have the strawberry swirl croissant. So first we're going to try the crust. It tastes like croissant, like an actual croissant, but the outside at least, like the, the border. And then the inside's like this really nice, it's really light, it's like a nice strawberry cream cheese, but lighter. It's more of a savory type of dessert. If you like more savory type of dessert, I would have to try this. It's very light. I don't think this is something that you would get if you're trying to get more flavorful things. This is more of a light reddish. It has a subtle like, taste. Yeah. Well, well that's, that's it, funny. funny. Next, we're going to try Haraz. Yes. So now we're going to try the Haraz Signature Latte, and I'm going to go ahead and give it a mix so we can get a better overall flavor. It has a lot of yummy flavors in it too, like aromatics. It's also very subtle, so it's definitely more on the bitter side, so if you like more rare coffee, then you should this one. I'm gonna try the uh, Haraz Bee Bites. So the Bee Bites have this cream cheese filling inside. It's kind of shaped like a honeycomb, so honeycomb. And then it has these black sesame seeds on top, and it's a pastry filled with cream cheese, and it's yummy style. Are you ready to try? All right, so we're going to go ahead and try this, but I'm gonna go ahead and take this honey um, dip out, and we're gonna go ahead and dip it. Personally, this is, it's kind of overpowered by the honey, but if you if you actually like honey, I think this would be a good dessert to try. It's very subtle, it's sweet cream cheese, the filling is very sweet, and it really complements the honey. Okay, so the pastry is really moist, and like Zayna said, the cream cheese kind of complements it. It's nice and sweet, and if you love honey, this is probably the favorite. And finally, we're going to have the Haraz Pistachio Cheesecake. This is what it looks like. So the pistachio cheesecake is more so just a cheesecake with pistachio drizzle on it. It's a very subtle taste of pistachio, but overall it's just a nice fresh cheesecake and I really like it. It's really good for the summertime especially and it's really nice and creamy. Like I love the texture of this. More of the pistachio flavor is coming from the drizzle and then maybe the nuts on top, but yeah. Yeah, and the texture complements everything really good. Yes. That's, That's for us! This is Zainab signing off. And this is Zara signing off. Thank you. Thank you.